we welcome you to the family people this is going to be a uh, part two of the uh, the uh, proportions tutorial and so we're just gonna zoom in a little bit and and this is from the previous the previous tutorial um, and so what I have here okay so to keep in mind remember from the previous tutorial I mentioned that the torso equals the two heads, you know, and at the same time, depending on you, the the age of the character will, you know, will show you like a difference in uh, proportions. Okay, so if you have an an, an adult character, okay, and in, in a like a, a fully grown adult character, this the torso here, you know, depending on like what style you're going for. The torso here is uh, will be equal to like uh, three torsos. I mean, three heads. I mean, so yeah. If it's an adult character, a teenage character, you know, or a young adult will be equal to uh, the two torsos, like how how this is, right here. Okay, and uh, a child here, like a kid. Uh, they they will be equal to like uh their torso will just be equal to one head, okay. And so another thing to keep in mind is that there there are like uh, differences in their uh, in each character's uh shoulder shoulder length, okay. So if you were to go on with a full adult character, okay. And let's uh, just say that we were doing it from, uh, you know, the cylinder. You know, we were starting from the uh, the cylinder, the egg shape. Okay, the the shoulder length would be equal to as many heads. Okay, so this is equal to like, uh, like, and what I mean by shoulder length is like the, the. Uh, the width you know like we're coming from here all right so this is what i mean by shoulder length so like an adult character will have like a shoulder length that's uh that's like equal that's like similar to like having three heads okay similar to having three heads that's the shoulder length if you were like move on to a teenage character uh, a teenage character will have it will be similar to this but it will be it will have like a it won't be all the way three heads okay so we'll just uh, draw it here just So, uh, a teenage character will have his his, uh, his or hers shoulder length going around here. Okay, it'll stop like a, around like in a half. Okay, so this would be like a, a two heads in a and a half it'll be like a half in terms of like shoulder length okay hoping you guys can see what I'm doing here okay so it'll be like a half in terms of like a, the shoulder length when, when we're doing teenagers so just pretend like as an we're erasing these these parts here so it'll just be like this okay and this will be like the shoulder length of a teenager okay and so when we're doing like a kid now a kid their they they, they their uh, shoulder length matches their their head 
you know the kids have the, the bigger heads and whatnot so Yeah, I'll, I'll just go from here, okay? Like if we were like just to draw the, the cylinder, okay? And like like depending on like the age of the kids, like if we had like a, a, a toddler or so, then this would just be like one head or so. If we were like a, I don't know, uh, I guess if this was a baby or so, this would be like one head. If we were like a, you know, ages of you know, five or six, you can like increase the top portion of the torso a little bit. But uh, yeah, and like it, remember in the uh, the version I showed you, I showed uh, the proportions, like people drawing like a, an egg shape and whatnot. To get your proportions down so that the torso would be like uh, two heads or so and whatnot and the, the, the pelvis would be one head if you saw the previous if you saw the uh, okay right like right here if you saw like the previous video and so this this is where you can like uh, start to you know form your shoulder levels you show the length based on the age of your character and whatnot, you know, so you could just, you know, do that. Like kind of like spread, spread it a little bit just to start drawing your, just to start uh, drawing your, uh, your shoulder, your shoulders. Okay. Depending on the characters, age and, and all that jazz. Okay. And so the subtle differences in the uh, depending on the age of your character, there's also a change not only in shoulder and shoulder width, but uh, there's a change in like arms and and legs, but not not too drastic from the previous versions from the previous tutorial. So, for example, adults here, for example, you'll have like, you know, their arms not reaching the point the belly button point okay like where their elbow is it doesn't reach the belly button the belly button point okay so the 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 elbow is like slightly upper as i showed in the previous version in the previous tutorial and so if you were to do like a, a teenager for example their 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 elbow area would would uh, match where the belly button is located okay so it would be like equal in length as as to like where the belly button is located that's where you uh would want to stop the upper arm okay adults are like just slightly bigger here so it's like more up here uh for toddlers rather you're drawing a uh just to finish this teenager here is you know same like but for, okay for toddlers here uh rather you're drawing a a, a baby or you know or, or yeah if rather you're drawing like ages of five or so the the only difference here would be just the the torso but uh, everything else would be equal to like one head okay so if i were to like yeah if i were to like draw like a the basic toddler okay we have his arms here And you can increase like the hand size, like depending on your style, the hand size still equals to one head. But uh, this this is just the basic toddler here.
and, and even though the pelvis would be equal to like one head okay and so so yeah ev everything you get the gist of it everything would just like be equal to like one head when you're drawing like a a, a toddler or and consider subscribing to the family so you can hit that and don't forget to uh hit the the red bell button for to get notified for when i upload every saturday so when you click that you'll see this you can click the chat box to send the notifications for you and then just save it i also provide you guys a discord or a place to chat my discord will be available in the link down below i provide references you know for anyone that want to you know look into it you know so i have references for you know ears breasts you know front torso back torso etc and including hands as well and this is where you can you know just chat with a family and you can share your artwork here etc that's just the basis of the discord check it out whatnot and that'll be the video thank you guys for watching peace out